Hello everyone, I wanted to share some truths about the recent settlement news from the National Association of Realtors, which have been widely misinterpreted by the media. It's time to set the record straight and debunk some of these misconceptions. There are two big changes from NAR. Offers of compensation will be prohibited from the MLS, all the realtors will still be able to display compensation in their own websites and their own listings. Realtors working with buyers will be required to enter into a written buyer broker agreement that show the amount of compensation, how the amount will be determined and where said amount will come from. Now let's hear some myths. Myth number one, realtors will no longer be able to set commissions, false. Commissions have always been negotiable and will continue to be negotiable. Myth number two, Americans will be able to negotiate real estate commissions for the first time. This one via President Joe Biden. False. With all due respect, Mr. President, real estate commissions have always been negotiable. This settlement will not alter that. Myth number three. Settlement forces brokers to reduce their compensation. False again. The market has always had a wide variety of fees reflecting different levels of service, marketing, and competence. This settlement doesn't dictate how brokers set their fees. And myth number four, sellers will no longer offer compensation to buyer's agents or prohibit sellers from paying a commission to a buyer's agent. False. Sellers will still offer compensation to buyer's agents. The settlement prohibits offer of compensation to be displayed in the MLS, not to be removed altogether. Sellers may still elect to pay buyer compensation and differentiate their properties. So there you have it, four debunked myths about the NAR settlement. We hope this discussion has helped set the record straight and brought some clarity to the topic.